Well, Outfest is the world's largest organization that promotes and protects LGBTQ stories on screen. And the group is kicking off the Outfronts Festival here in L.A. this week. Now, there will be some really exciting premieres, screenings, and panel discussions. And here to tell us more is Outfest Executive Director Damian Navarro and actor George Sears. Welcome. Hey, hey. Amy. How are you? Really good. It's so nice to have you both here. Thanks for um, us. Let's get right into it. Tell us first about Outfest. This has been around for a long time. Yeah, Outfest is celebrating its 40th anniversary this mm -hmm. year. It began as a group of PhD UCLA film students that came together in 1982, mm -hmm. wanting to have deeper conversations around what was happening in the industry. And mm -hmm. fast forward to today, Outfest is now a global organization that has many different programs, including two film festivals, our mm -hmm. famous Outfest Los Angeles, which kicks off July 14th, mm -hmm. and more importantly, has started to expand into other mediums like television. Yeah, yeah. And so the Outfront event that's coming up this year, George, you're very much involved with that because of your, I guess, debut of the yes, new season? Yes, I believe we're the first in-person panel. Um, and yeah, they're going to be showing the first episode of the new season. Mm -hmm. So um, we'll get to find out about that cliffhanger. Yeah. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited. It's going to be great to like see the instant response. Mm -hmm. yeah. How mm -hmm. important do you think it is that there is a voice and, and a place for all of these shows and actors to just really hear and see what's happening? Well, looking back in time, I mean, we've always wanted to find new places to come together as a community <laughs> to celebrate one another's work as artists. Mm -hmm. um, and even more so now when you have things like like South By and Comic-Con, like our community wants to come and celebrate the people that they see on television and in streaming um, in the same ways. And so I think it's extremely important as we continue to evolve to find new spaces where everybody can come together and really celebrate these characters and stories that are, are moving the meter, if you will. Mm -hmm. And can you give us a little more of uh, what people will see this year? Yeah, we've got, you know, last year was incredible, but it was only virtual. So mm -hmm. we're kicking off on Friday night, this Friday, with Peacock's Queer as Folk reimagining down at the Ace Downtown. And then at Neuhaus this weekend, uh, on Saturday, we start off, of course, with the cast of Love, Victor, and mm -hmm. sneak peeking the first episode mm -hmm. of season three. Uh, and then we have one of my favorites, which is our Queer Firefighters panel. Um, and that's where we have characters like Ronan Robinstein, Ronan, Ronan Robinstein Brian Michael Smith, mm -hmm. Raphael Silva, uh, Tracy Toms that are going to come and oh. talk about what it's like to play heroes both on camera and really talk about subjugating that into what it's like to do in real life. Wow. And George, you got to tell us a little bit more about La Victor. Yeah. I mean, tell us about how the season, last season ended and, and what we might be able to expect. Well, yeah, season. so it did end on like a big cliffhanger, yeah. but this season, I would say it um, matures with the characters, oh, okay. some of the things that they go through. And also we knew it was going to be the last one when we were making it. So oh. we kind of all got to say like, uh, I think I think it comes full circle mm -hmm. and we say a very good like goodbye to oh. these characters and their stories okay. and what they've been through. And okay. um, yeah, I think it's, I think people are going to like it. A little, yeah. a little bit of a tearjerker, I'm afraid. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> well, thank you both for joining us today. And if you want more information about Outfest and the Outfronts by going to kcal9.com and clicking on Scene on TV.